decades of hard work with lots of volunteers has come to an end. The Little Campbell Creek Restoration Project is about complete with some future monitoring planned to see just how the fish are recovering. A look at what the project at Meadow Park really means for fish traveling through Anchorage. What we want to do is see that, um, find out if the fish are actually using this the way we expected them to use it. The project spearheaded by the Anchorage Waterways Council and lots of volunteers, from Polaris students to local businesses and government agencies. They all pitched in to save the lives of countless fish along Little Campbell Creek. And what you can see is that you have Little Campbell Creek, it's not flowing directly into the alcove, and that's on purpose because... What we want is the water quality to actually be a little bit better in the alcove than in the creek. Because what fish biologists discovered a few years back was there were lots of fish in Little Campbell Creek. In fact, this was the rearing ground for salmon, rainbow trout, and Dolly Varden. The problem was they were dying off because of bad water quality, high sediment levels when water levels were high. That's why this backwater wetland alcove was created. We are providing them an escape hatch. They can swim into this alcove and the water is much calmer here and will be better water quality and not so full of sediment. So they can hang out in this alcove area and escape from the poor water quality conditions and then they can go back in the creek after the storm is over, so to speak. The project also revealed that Little Campbell Creek is a more important fish rearing habitat than expected, greatly affecting runs along Campbell Creek. So what this is going to do is it's going to provide a much healthier habitat um, for those juvenile salmon. So while they stay in the freshwater system for two to three years, um, they have a high, will have a higher survivability rate. The other part of the equation, the human factor. The Waterways Council says it's more important than ever that we keep the water and surrounding area clean. Understanding that whatever goes into a storm drain has a direct effect on the fish. You should consider those as gateways directly to the creek because that water runs down into that storm drain and in most cases flows directly to a creek. If you want the adult fish that come into Campbell, you really need to protect areas like this and make habitat for the juvenile fish. In an alcove that's also expected to provide some wintering habitat for the juvenile fish, a deeper area away from the very shallow parts of the creek that freeze completely. A grassroots project with a big impact for some little fish on Little Campbell Creek. So really, thank you so much for, for making everything happen. Following the completion of the project, the creek will be monitored to see how the alcove is working and if the fish numbers improve because of the improved habitat.